Yes, and I don't know, just the sound of Iceland, Iceland. is a good <laughs> idea right yeah, now. We'll all be wanting to go there, but the airport will be packed on Sunday. It will be. Oh, my God. It's going to be so hot here, uh -huh. and we've already got excessive heat watches and warnings that will be going into effect this mm. weekend. So, I mean, we are talking triple digits even at the beaches. Huh. That's the problem, too. Yeah. I mean, we can get through it, thank goodness, but I just hope brush fires don't... You're right. Right. That's, that's the big concern. We've got a lot yeah. of dry vegetation, but boy, doesn't this look nice? <laughs> and it's actually cool at the coast right now, where we're showing you, and all these folks are already enjoying the waters. You will definitely want to be in the water this weekend, especially on starting on Sunday, Father's Day. Maybe take Dad to the beach. All right, let's take a look at our temperatures out there right now. We've got temperatures into the 70s, uh, but we've got some strong southwesterly winds. So the onshore flow. Is what kept us actually on the cool side today. Temperatures stayed below average. We had a high today in the low 70s. Uh, and again, that is because we had the cloud cover to start off the first half of the day. But now it has cleared all the way to the coast. So again, just a gorgeous day. One more uh, beautiful day. And then we start the warm up as we head into the end of the week and the weekend. So let's first talk, talk about the high surf advisory. You saw all the folks in the waters, but uh, we still have high surf in effect through 10 p.m. on Thursday. That's for surf that could get up to around eight feet, so do be careful out there. Look at this. Now, the latest to be issued for the excessive heat watch has been LA and Ventura counties. That goes into effect on Monday. And last through Tuesday, excessive heat watches go into effect for San Bernardino, Orange County, and Riverside counties on Sunday for temperatures that will be anywhere between about 100 to 110 degrees. Some areas even warmer than that. Even at the coast, we are looking at highs into the mid 90s to even triple digits in the coastal valleys. So, again, it is going to be extremely hot, very dangerous, starting on Sunday, lasting through Tuesday of next week. But right now, the reason we've got the nice, cool weather is this trough of low pressure bringing us the onshore flow. It is this ridge of high pressure right here that is going to be building in. Uh, right now it's producing quite the heat wave across the nation's midsection, but as it builds into our area, the heat is going to come with it. And again, it will be very hot out there. Uh, so again, it is definitely a concern because it will be uh, dangerous outside with the heat. If you're traveling tomorrow, heading out of Burbank, 79 for the high. Uh, let's take a look at the rest of your travel forecast. 90s in Vegas, 66 with rain in San Fran, uh, 99 in Palm Springs, 71 in San Diego. All right, here is a look at that very brutal forecast that I've been talking to you about. Next few days, very nice. Even Saturday, not too bad. But Sunday is the day the heat will be on again. And 90s to triple digits, the hottest day right now. Monday, 90s at the beaches, triple digits in the LA and OC metro areas, 110 inland. Back to you guys. Good Thursday morning. I'm Jackie Johnson, and here is your wake up weather. We do have some clouds out there this morning, but get ready. It's going to be a sunny, beautiful day with highs into the mid 70s. Have a great one.